Hey guys, D Mike here for another episode of Super Nintendo Sunday's Do Re Mi. Last week had a bit of a skip. Try to get things back in order, but here we are with some more Do Re Mi. I honestly don't know how much of this game is left, so I'm just gonna keep playing until we get to the floaty wizard, the scarecrow on the left, Eamon, I'm assuming that's who that is, famous Eamon. We're gonna keep at it. If you enjoy keeping at it, if you could comment on this video, if you want to, liking it is very good, and subscribing to stay up to date. All the good things in your life that you need, all part of a balanced breakfast. Whoa, okay. I mean, it is spooky season, so... Whoop. Yeah, I have no idea what to expect. These hands? What is happening? I don't think I can step on that. Looks pretty spiky. <laughs> it is? Okay. I've got a feeling this is going to be going very poorly for me. Oh, this game is crazy. It's amazing to me. I think if I'm doing the math correctly. Whoa, okay. It's like those uh, alligator heads in Donkey Kong Country 2. Um, this is the 17th episode of this series of Do Re Mi. No idea what this game was like when I, oh, when I first started, but um, I, as you know, on this channel, I'm very much into platformers, very big fan, at least the reasonable ones. And uh, yeah, I, I just kind of did the old Googling to find this game. I'd never heard of it before, I've never seen it. Just felt like the right thing to, wait. How am I? Okay. <laughs> uh, all right. I think that's how we vanquish that spot. What a tricky puzzle. I've got a feeling these, uh, these ghosts, these spooky ghosts are gonna cause me some trouble. It's very appropriate that there are ghosts in this episode, considering it's Halloween Eve. Ooh. Kind of shocked I got through that unscathed. Is that... Oh, this music's fun. This music's incredible. Why haven't they used this before? We got Garlic Jr. coming after us. This is ridiculous. <laughs> okay. Everything... Everything is so hateful. Okay. Definitely was uh, bubbling, but did not count. Yeah, this music rocks. What on earth? Or what on Eamon's castle? Whoa, okay, that's the ground. Thankfully that we have our bubble gun to rescue us. Okay, I probably just wasted that. Cause now I don't know where our ground, oh. <laughs> that was luck. I don't know where our ground is. Oh boy, uh. Is this a platform? It is not. Uh, where do you expect me to go now? I'm pretty sure that there's nothing over here, right? Nope, there's not. There's death. That's over there. Fun! Okay. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident that my, uh... My quota of, like, two levels-ish is gonna hold true here given the nature of what I'm struggling with so far. I don't think I'm gonna get too far, so... We're gonna do our best, as we always do here on Super Nintendo Sundays on DMI Industries at War. Yeah, I think that's a one and done kind of thing. Yeah, to save those... those pathways, little... Yeah, okay. Yep, you do. Well, you live and you learn, viewers. Oh my gosh, these ghosts can uh, go through walls. Can you come here? I need to jump on you. Okay, that did not work. <laughs> can you come back? Ugh. Am I really not... Oh wait, can I do the... Yes, viewers, we have not forgot our, forgotten our old tricks. It has been... Okay. <laughs> We forgot the oldest trick in the book, to not run into enemies. Oh boy, viewers, we're trying. Our best, you might say. I was proud of how well I did in that first attempt of spooky spooky world here, in these staircases. All right, well, you know what? Maybe this time, 
maybe this time we don't uh, goof it and keep our bubble gum. How about that, viewers? Maybe you can give me a hand. All right. Whoa. Okay. 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 I mean, I do like that there's a little bit of, you know, novelty in the hands that are before us. It's not all the same thing. Okay. These tossy hands, though, oof. They make me a little noitous. Yeah, they do. All right. So far, so good. I mean, this game is a platform of viewers, and if you weren't ready for that, then, well, you haven't been paying attention to the previous 16 episodes, which I am astounded by. I don't know if that is, like, bad, if, like, 16 episodes is bad, or, you know, if it's kind of par for the course. I feel like I haven't really had too much trouble in general, except for some of the boss fights. Those ones have been pretty... Pretty mischievous. Boop. All right. I'm gonna jump on your spooky ghost head. Very good. Yeah, this part's a little, ooh, a little tricky here. You just gotta kind of duck. You don't want to be stuck in the palm of their hand here. But we're doing okay. Yeah, I mean this game, this game is weird and it's different. Which I know that the word weird has a negative, negative connotation. So I don't really want to say that. I don't think this game is bad by any stretch of the imagination. I think it is very whimsical and fun. It is different. I don't think weird is bad. I think weird is fine. Weird is what you make it. Create your own normal, viewers. Don't let people tell you what to do. You, you do you, viewers. Do yourself. It's always good to play with yourself, okay. So last time, I was able to get up there. Okay. I completely forgot that I did not do that. I used the the uh, the magic the magic ladder. I almost forgot to say the word magic. The ma I almost said magic ladder. The magic ladder. Okay. I was ready for him that time. Sort of. Okay. Not today. All right. Now is that a grab from this side? It is. I feel like I'm missing one, but there are still levels to be had. I don't know what is going to be happening. Whoa. I think I might have taken him out on accident. Okay. Viewers, we did it. Only two tries on our first try. Okay. So let's see. I don't know. I feel like I'm missing the... The magic pieces? How do you know how many you have? I only need one more. Viewers, one more. Una mas. Got some keys here. Uh, what? Mario 64? Miyamoto, you totally stole this idea. Jumping in paintings. I wonder, what's the first game, viewers? You know it, because I don't. This is not a trivia question. Um, what's the first game out there that featured jumping into paintings? Whoa, you guys are coming hot. Stop it. I'm just trying to collect music notes. Okay, so that just loops back around to the beginning. I've got a feeling this is going to be the shtick of this level. Do I need to jump in all of these? I don't know, but I'm going to because... Why not? All right, so we don't want to get speared. That's a sticking point of this level you don't really want to deal with. I have a really bad habit of holding the letter Y when I play. We're playing Donkey Kong. Y, y button simulator, that's what that is. Whoa, okay. All right, not so bad. This isn't horrible yet. You just gotta be on your toes a little bit. So we have these little facades here. I think three lives, honestly, might be the most lives that I've had at like any one time since like halfway through this Let's Play. That's incredible. We got three lives. We have green pants. Uh, viewers, we are really rocking and rolling here. Gotta kill Dobby the Elf here. There we go. 
was never a uh, never caught on to the the Harry Pottering when I was a kid. Read the books, some of them, but uh, yeah, never really was uh, huge about it. One of the things that I think is a little strange, and this is not meant to be a huge judgment call, so I apologize if I ruffle any feathers with this statement. But I know some people who were uh, very much so adults now when the Harry Potters of the world came out, which I think is well and fine. You can't control when you're born. Um, what I do think it's weird is how people that are, you know, we're talking like middle-aged older, the obsession sometimes that they have with things like Harry Potter. All right, it looks like that might've been the way to go forward. The obsession they could have with a children's series that they uh, still aggressively pursue well into their, their later years. Enjoy whatever you like, viewers, that's for sure. All right, so these nasty sides. Can we jump on them? Like we probably cannot. Okay, we cannot. All right, I think I have to jump over them. Actually, I don't know. I feel like I can't touch the the pole. Can't touch the shaft, unfortunately. Jump under them. Avoiding the keys. Whoa, okay. Not too bad. Would love some new pants. If I could afford that. You ever notice how expensive pants are? I don't buy pants very often, but man, they are expensive. I don't even know the last time I bought pants. Usually I just do the, oh, really? I normally do the smart thing and I just ask for clothes for the holidays. What holidays do you enjoy, viewers? It's almost Halloween. Halloween is actually, I'm recording this the day before Halloween. I'm recording this on the day that it goes up because I've been very busy. But um, yeah, Halloween's definitely my favorite holiday, although I don't do enough for it. I just like the idea of it, maybe. If you're in the US and A, the 4th of July is a fun one as well. Have a little cookout, hang out with your, your friends. People enjoy Turkey Day, that's Thanksgiving. Whoa! All right, so, so I think it's the third painting. We went in the second one that was not the right one. This is like a little bit of a puzzle, but thankfully it's not like Mario the lost levels where um, you had to pick the right pipe. You had to hit the right pipe in order to proceed. Whoa. The ghost was like, oh, wait for me. I want to hang out. All right, this looks different. Okay. Woo. What a crazy. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I mocked the game and then I failed. Whoa. Okay. At least they are giving us a healthy amount of. Music notes, and they start us here with pants. Very kind. Uh, I think we need to go kind of with it. Yes. It's a little tricky being on an incline here. All right. We have avoided the dastardly puzzle. I'm gonna try to grab as many of these music notes as I can, obviously. I'm trying to rack up them lives. We don't know what's going to befall us. I think I just walk into this one. Oh, you know, you know what? I bubbled. I bubbled your butthole. You bubble butthole. All right. No, 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 no. I do like the design of these ghosts, though. Both when they're bubbled and when they're not. Okay. So it appears that. Is that the second? Of the... I think that was the second one. Check the third, unless I was wrong and I'm going into the third twice, because my memory is horrible. Uh, this looks like, this looks different. Uh, nope. Or maybe it's not. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> okay, so, whoa. Whoa. So door three was not the correct choice. It was door number two. Door number three followed by door number two. At least there's no real punishment for it. We do to listen to this funky music. I, I like this. That like jazz triangle. Oh yeah. Who doesn't love a good jazz triangle? I don't think there's anything back here. No, just the end of the hallway. More set design to enjoy. All right, door number two it is. Psst, tss, tss, tss. 
No! Viewers! Okay, so these guys are impervious to my attacks. Okay, can't go up there. Super cool. Oh. All right, so we can only pass through the the pillars here. And I don't think we can, we're not doing damages to these guys, so. They are permanent obstacles. Maybe we can jump up from here, go on this side. No, we cannot. You have to be really gutsy to Go up the other side and try to time that. I don't think you can jump over these things. At least not well. Just a curiosity here. Okay, probably would help if I would have actually hit something. I did not. What a cool puzzle. Oh my. Yes, yeah, so you're not doing damage that side. Looks like the... Uh, okay, so looks like we have to wait, viewers. I'm impatient. I'm not a doctor, I have no patience. So I'm gonna go down here. Go into this plethora of blocks. Very good. Double pants. Wonderful. We will sidestep this lad here. And we will have made it. All right, so we're still looking for that final... Oof. We're still looking for the final magic star. Ooh, bubbles. I don't actually know what the power-ups do in this game, if anything. Like, I know that... This is supposed to be the one that lets you shoot further, but I don't know if it does actually do that. Okay, we can't do that. How do I get up here? Do I have to run and jump? I'll have to jump on these guys. No. Okay, come back. Please stop. <laughs> Alright, we will take your friend. And miss completely. There we go. That was pretty pretty sweet maneuver. You're welcome, viewers. Alright. More keys among us. Oh, okay. Well. Is that it? Oh. Maybe the magic star is in that one. Alright. Well, that's all the time we've got for today. Thanks for watching, viewers. If you enjoyed this video, if you could like the video, comment on it if you feel like it, and subscribe for more delicious goodies. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sunday's Do Re Me, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.